How's it going, YouTube? Ornum here. Welcome back to episode 21. That's a lot of episodes. But I'm just collecting some birch wood so that I can build another house. So there isn't too many houses in this village. I mean, we've got the little hut. But I need more houses so that when I add villages, they will have a place to stay. Hmm, I'm not sure whether I want to add another house here or not. Could block the view of the tent. So, in between episodes, I realized I was always running low on food, and I just decided to farm some carrots. So, I also decided that I would finish out the farm so that I could take the thumbnail. I'll show you guys that after I get to sleep. I also really quickly need to gather more dark oak wood. There we go. So, I just decided to make them out of stairs and slabs so I could build the roof. I think I might go for a bit of a different roof design this time. So I'm actually changing up the roof style for this one a bit. I've been building too much with just the same old uh, triangular roofs that you can see over there. So I want to do a bit of a fantasy one. It will be the same roof design as our tent over there. It will just fit in a bit with the area too. I was thinking because we're going for a different type of build style, uh, or different roof style I guess you could say, um, I might make this a mage's hut. If you really want to say that, this could even be a potion store, because they're basically the same thing. Oh, did you see how smooth that running across the build was? Oh. Hopefully this time with the roof design, I built it a lot better than I built that tent over there. Because, oh, that was a disaster. It's raining quite heavy in the game, but I did some horns on top of the roof, I guess you'd call it. Um, it really it really looks like a, a fantasy build. Just mining out here on each side so that we can add a window. And we've actually got the exact materials I wanted to use, not placing it there though. But I just wanted to use some fences because I think they look really nice with this style of build. We obviously need to light up inside so no mobs spawn, but we've got our roof design. Let's go look at it from afar. I actually like that. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. It might be a little bit too straight up here, but we can fix that another time. For now, it looks nice. At least we're expanding the village like a lot further than just adding a house every like two steps. I'm, I'm gonna lock them up in here and try and get the right potions that I need. It's like an indoors. Ah. Hopefully they don't despawn because they're indoors, but I don't think that I have any potions or brewing stands because I need to go to the nether and get blaze rods and as you guys know with my track record of the nether not great <laughs> I had lanterns in my inventory the whole time why didn't I know that I figured we should check on our axolotl in the pond I don't know if it's still there it is hello little buddy what do these guys eat I'm not even sure to be honest I also want to venture like this way because I don't think I've been here and I see pumpkins so, this could be the spot I was talking about a few episodes ago where I wanted to build the pumpkin patch. Actually, I think that was probably close to 10 episodes ago by now. I mean, there's free food and free mobs here, so... Here's the cave we haven't been in. Might as well check this out. Could be new chunks. Diamonds, possibly. Probably not. Yo, I was not recording, but I just had a goat ram into me. Like, quite literally... Like, literally, as my recording stopped, I had a goat run into me. Can you run into this block, mate, please? Oh, how do they ram into stuff? Oh, come on, mate. Does it really have to be two blocks tall? Oh, fine, fine, whatever. I give up. So I really badly want to collect some spruce wood and spruce saplings because it's my favorite type of wood and I don't know if I've ever said that but I love spruce wood, specifically the logs and the trapdoors, my favorite type of wood. I need to remember which direction my base is so that I don't get lost because I feel like that is something that I would do. Not going to make the same mistake where I don't pick up the sugar cane. <laughs> Thank you. 
I might just make this episode about going on an adventure, to be honest, like exploring everywhere. I ended up recording a video that was about me, like, exploring the new update, and I didn't like the video, so it's completely scrapped. I'm already down to 26 carrots. My hunger is going so fast. Look, it's a little turtle. Hello, Mr. Turtle. It's getting nighttime. Or wow, that came out of the blue. This is like a really weird small ravine, like some sort of crevice, I guess you'd call it. Don't want to fall in there, though. It doesn't seem like there's much out this way, but over there seems like a pretty cool spot I could build at. I see ice over there, I should have brought my Iron Silk Touch pickaxe. These ice biomes, they're supposed to be rare, but I see them all the time, it's just I never get the materials from them. Is that a different type of ice? What is that? Or is it just snow? Is it really just snow piled up that high? Not these guys. Don't like them at all. What? They really give you slowness through your shield. Did you guys see that? I'm running low on food. I want to get out of this biome, back to my house as soon as I can. Oh, I've still got slowness. How long? How do I check? How do I check? I don't know how speedrunners and stuff do this jump trick. Like, I can't do it well. Oh, oh wow, I just I just hit three. I'm taking these three cacti so that I can maybe make a, a farm out of it. You know, I've got some sand on me too. Oh, that's annoying. Well, another creeper explosion to add to my world. Oh! I was I was spam clicking too. I even got a crit. I've got a lot of food. 20 raw mutton, 24 pork chops, and 12 beef. Probably got chicken too, right? Yeah, two chicken. That's a lot of meat. Oh, I have nine leather too. I've been looking for leather. I keep forgetting I need leather. Hopefully, I'm heading the right direction. But no, I'd say it's this way considering my cords are changing. Yeah, I think I need to be at, like, uh, negative 50, positive 50, or something around that area. I'm sorry to this baby chicken for what it's about to witness. I'm really sorry. I'm heading in the completely wrong direction, but I found a village, so I'm going to capitalize on that. Sorry, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Alrighty, I'm not sorry. I'm doing speedrunner things where I'm critting the iron golem. There we go, give me your iron. Did you just see that black cat? There we go, look at that. I could have had that if I just got some fish. Do they kill rabbits? I need to rescue this villager. There we go. You good, bro? It's a villager rescue mission. <laughs> Let's go. I need both my coordinates to decrease this way. There we go. Peonies, peonies. Oh my god. I need these so bad. And I'm already down to eating raw potatoes as a food source. At least I don't have to get into the raw meat just yet. Guys, that's a four tall sugar cane. I thought they only grew to three. Someone let me know in the comments if that's a new thing. More sheep for me to kill, yes. Wait, do they die by one hit? They do. It's because my axe has sharpness too. Is it the same for pigs, or do they have more health? No, they have more health. I still need to crit pigs. Luckily, I'm a pro now. <laughs> I'm joking, by the way. I'm obviously not a pro. And I get a lot of comments of people saying, like, how good my builds are, or how good I am at Minecraft. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. Like, <laughs> what are you talking about? I recognize this portal, which means my base is right over here. Let's go. No. I guess I can eat one raw beef. Oh, look, you can see my farm. That's my farm, isn't it? This new house is incredibly close to the village. Wow. Now we're finally back home, and I'd like to play some of the peonies in uh, both of the gardens I have. The, the big one and the small one. There we go. It just adds a slight bit more color. Just a little bit. And I love that. I'm just smelting some of the food. Uh, thank you guys for watching the video, and I'll catch you next time.